How's it going people? It's your boy Biggs from Digital Mods and welcome to the channel. On this video, I wanted to cover Gamescom 2017 and what we might expect to see because in my opinion, it's the true heart of gaming and more important in the gaming calendar than E3. Every year, Gamescom gets bigger. Not only does its 340,000 public attendees make E3's 15,000 audience look like a back garden tea party, this year the show will also be accommodating over 900 exhibitions, making a 20% increase year on year. That's over three times the amount of exhibitions at E3 in 2016. That's great from a numbers perspective, but more voices competing for the same amount of attention, it can become increasingly difficult to make your game stand out from the crowd. But Gamescom still remains a crucial date in the gaming calendar every year. Whether it's networking, announcing new titles, or placing orders with key partners, Gamescom's ever-swelling numbers only re reflect its growing importance on the world stage. While there'll be a vast range of developers and games present at Gamescom 2017, some companies go the extra mile and hold dedicated press conferences prior or during the conference. While many take place in Cologne, they may also be available to watch online. While Microsoft isn't hosting a dedicated press conference during Gamescom 2017, the company is planning to host a Xbox Gamescom live broadcast, which falls on the 20th of August and that's a Sunday. The live stream is set to begin 8pm UK time or 9pm local time and will feature interviews with developers, the latest and upcoming games, and of course new gameplay and footage, and more information about the new Xbox One X hardware, which a lot of us are expecting and excited to see what they're going to release information wise at Gamescom. In a turn of events, Nvidia will also be hosting a dedicated event at Gamescom 2017. It's the first time the company has held a press conference at the German Expo and it's said to include exclusive hands-on opportunities for members of the press. Nvidia will also be hosting a stage show that will be live streamed from the event. While we're not quite sure what will be featured in the show, it's due to begin at 10am UK time or 11am local time. It will premiere on the 21st of August and that falls on a Monday. EA is set to live stream. That takes place on the 21st of August also. The time it will be published is 5.30pm UK time or 6.30pm local time, the day before the show officially begins. While the company is holding its cards close to its chest for now, we expect to see brand new gameplay and footage from games including Star Wars Battlefront 2, Need for Speed Payback, FIFA 18 and that's just to name a few. Much like the Xbox team, Nintendo isn't hosting a dedicated press conference at Gamescom this year. The company has announced that it will stream several live shows on its YouTube account throughout the conference. The first Nintendo show will go live on the 23rd of August and that's a Wednesday. It will start at 2pm UK time, 3pm German time to catch a glimpse at the latest Super Mario Odyssey gameplay and interviews with the developers too. Then on Thursday the 24th of August at 11am UK time, 12pm local time, Nintendo will showcase gameplay for its brand new up and coming Nintendo 3DS game Metroid. And one of the biggest bits of news that's circulating is that Sony hasn't proper gave confirmation if they're going to attend Gamescom this year. I'm not sure why they don't attend in previous years but it would be kind of silly not to attend the biggest gaming event of the year. So be hundreds of different demos and exhibitions viewable on the Gamescom channel, which the schedule should be released in the next few days. But I'd love to know what you're looking forward to at Gamescom this year. Me personally, I'm looking forward to the Xbox live stream and more information about the Xbox One X and more titles. But that's my little update for today. Please like, subscribe and thanks for watching the video. It's your boy Biggs and I'm out. Thank you.